Hello dear viewer, I'm Lee Sass, welcome back to House Flipper. Uh, we're going to do a little job for somebody today, but before we do that, we've got something else to do first. A little confession, which is that I've, I've, been, I've been playing House Flipper by myself for a change. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I know I usually record all of it, but I, I so it's lack of time. So sometimes when I get a chance to play is not when I get a chance I'm able to record at the same time, at least not without someone turning up and shouting at me to shut up and it's the middle of the bloody night <laughs> so i um i did a little, i bought a house and did a little jobby poo is what i did so we bought i bought um a camping bungalow which is a tiny one it's pretty much the same size as the one we're in here uh not too bad it's a little different from here because it has got a washer in there um but it, it's instead of um, doing what I'd done in the past, which is where I'd had some silly plan about who I wanted to sell the house to before I started. This one, I went along there and did some decorating um, and just started to see, you know, who, who was throwing their hand in and who they were going, going to go for it. In fact, you can guess, if you can, as we go in, who, who, it's, who I've actually de dedicated it to in the end. So I did the brickwork, which is, which is much nicer. I prefer that in here. Okay. And so we've, I've kept the structure exactly the same. So we have a kitchen here, and we have a bathroom here, and we have a, a main room in here, a living room. Okay, now early on, I started to... Actually, you can read two of those four, because they're, they're the people at the top of the chain. It's the old people, the Gentiles. Um, things I discovered, though, which is why I wanted to show you this. Things I discovered while I was doing it. I haven't done much of a wallpaper before, because wallpaper is kind of old-fashioned. But it's it sort of nice. It's got a nice, it's got a nice wallpapery texture to it. It's got a definite feeling of fluffiness and depth to it. High-quality wallpaper. Kind of nice. And it gives you a little dado rail to go with it as well, which is which is good. So when I was doing it, um, basically was just trying to do a, a simple setup for now. So, yeah, I put the kitchen in. I didn't get too fancy. Hold on a second. Those are moved. I did not put them down there, thank you very much. That's kind of bizarre. I've never had that before. You heard that? Things moving around? Spookums. Anything else moved? No? Okay. Um, Fucking okay, Chester works? Good. Okay, nothing else has changed. I don't think so. Yeah, so I started to put it together, and uh, my initial move was to say, uh, bedroom. Okay, so I put a bed in here, and then all sorts of people started to show interest. Um, it was uh, Raphael, of course, showed up the jerk that he is, and uh, I think Gorge Georgia, I don't know point. Of course, uh, Donald was in there. Oh my god, I didn't call him Dolan for a change. Donald was in there showing some, he's still there, in fact, despite the fact there's no ruddy office whatsoever. And the people that are there, I mean, Jimmy stuck his nose in the door, uh, even though I, I just ignored him. I blanked him entirely. After his last performance, I'm just ignoring him. He doesn't, he's dead to me, okay? Bloody Jimmy. So, uh, they're, they're fairly sensible, the people are in here, apart from maybe, um, oh, we're missing uh, the student, aren't we? Uh, Chang Choi. Why is this on the floor? Oh, it's an old tile. I thought it was a chopping board for a second. Okay, everyone calm down. It's okay. Don't worry. <laughs> Stop stressing. <laughs> it was, uh, they make sense to most of the people that are here, apart from possibly Dolan. And uh, the bell people started to have interest, but as soon as I put the bed in, they lost a bit of interest. And then I thought, well, maybe they want a living room. So I built, I built a little wall across here and I started to do a living room. But of course, that was too many rooms. So they left. And I was like, it was, does still seem like a good place for them to be in. So I took the bed out. So in fact, there's no bedroom in this house at all. I don't see the purpose of this house. I can imagine if you've got a house that you want to convert, you could make it into an office. That happens quite a lot. You know, simple businesses like, well, simple physical businesses such as things like solicitors and uh, uh, like accountants, things like that. Sometimes they set up houses in, they set up shop literally in a, in a residential house and they convert it into an office. And you can imagine D Donald taking this, turning this into an office. You have a toilet, a little tiny kitchenette and the rest of his office space. Makes perfect sense. But what, what what's happening here with this being a house? Where, where do the old people sleep? Why does anyone want to sleep in here? Jimmy's, don't know why Jimmy's back actually. There's no bedroom in here now. But where, it's just a living room, a kitchen. Are you going to sleep in the rocking chair? This game is very strange. 
for that kind of thing. Also, I've discovered, although the old people like certain things, I look at the buyers, you can go too far with something, apparently. So, uh, pictures, carpets, did that with the carpets. Kitchen, yeah, good, good. Give them a bigger cooker. Living room. Um, they like a living room more than a bedroom. <laughs> this second carpet. Oh, there's loads of stuff they like it on here. Lots of things they like on there. Okay. They like plants as well, though. However, I went to one point where I added one more plant, and suddenly they went down. Apparently, there's you can have too many plants, apparently. So you're going to watch out for that. They, it, it, you could actually push people too far one way, which is which is kind of bizarre. The balancing of this game is very odd. But anyway, this house, I'm pretty happy. I'm pretty happy with this. I thought I'd struggle with a little property. Apart from the lack of bedroom, I'm pretty happy with this room than I am with most of the ones I've done. It's got the feeling of old people's stuff. Look, it's pictures of pictures of grandkids there and the, the cat and a, it's either a flower or part of nachos? I don't know, hard to tell. Bunch of books, not really laid on the shelf probably, but it feels like an old person's house and kitchen. And I thought it was kind of clean and nice. I, I yeah, I'm I'm happy with this one. Pretty happy with it. So we're gonna sell this. It's done, as far as I can see. I didn't see any dirt or anything on there that I've missed. Uh, okay, no, we're just going to sell it. Right, let's see what we can get out of the old people. Um, didn't cost me very much. Uh, shut up, Jack. Bought it for 25 thou. Kitchen, yeah, that's fine. No, no music or TV. Um, Without a bedroom, I know what you mean, Chang. I like. I think I like you, Chang. I think we'll do one for you in the future, maybe. But um, yeah, there's no bedroom, so why are you even here, J Jimmy? Uh, 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 keep going. <laughs> what? Why are you second on the list? Then this is one only one bedroom. I mean, I don't know. Um, I thought this is this is more. She should be up the head. I don't know. The rooms are perfect. Oh my god! Oh, three rooms are perfect. I better say. Oh. I thought for a second they were saying that the rooms were perfect. Living room, bathroom, kitchen, more pictures than Mary out. Ah, remember that for next time. Several carpets, could get that right. And that's place to put our books. Living room, old fashioned furniture. Yeah, so the, the, the other thing is the furniture sorting thing is doesn't, I don't think it works. The filter doesn't work on the, on the shop. Okay, because I looked for look, old versus new. And it didn't make sense of it. So uh, all I've been doing is trying to put later on anything with classical in the title. That goes in. And in fact, the sofa, I think it's called an archaic sofa. So anything to do with age, put that in. But don't use the filters because it doesn't work properly as far as I can see. Not many wooden elements. I couldn't do much more wooden. I did actually wonder, if I did the outside of the house in wood. Wood. <laughs> that joke. Would that count? Um, anyway, um, profit, for, let's get a bit more money out of the old people. Um, I recently got another buff in negotiation. And it's actually, because it's a, this appears to be a percentage of the property that they're spending. This is, this is how much you're taking here. So if the house is found to 200,000, here will be a lot more money than this one, which is a cheap property. But we're going to go for another, as we've got another skill, we're going to push our luck. For another 5,000. I think they're good for it. I think they're good for it. Um, here we go. Whoa! Okay. I can't negotiate again. I went too far. I was too greedy. It's fine. Just enough. But not enough bedroom. I prefer pastel colours on the walls. We don't care. We've already sold to you, I think. Have we sold to her? I can't remember anymore. Yeah, we did sell to her, didn't we? Right. Now I actually do what I was planning on doing in this video. Um, might be a slightly longer video. We'll see. We'll see what uh, this gentleman wants. Max. Max. Garage smiley face. Ooh, I bought a new car. There's so much trash I can't find in my garage. Can you please clean up my garage so I can have, some, have somewhere to park? Regards, Max. If you wash my car, I'll pay you extra. Max. Is this your carriage? <laughs> oh my hell. Uh, you're gonna deal, mate. It's a. Oh, wait, this seems familiar. It's like the bunker garage. This is. Uh, it's just a garage. There's a whole plot just for. What car have you got in here, mate? It better be something nice. For a, for a garage as big as this. Wow. That's. Uh, I was just working on a house that was smaller than this. 
Okay, yeah. Oh, it really is filthy in there. Get Mac, what have you been doing in there? That's not even a very good car, Max. My, my goodness, really. Okay, it's not too bad. It's a cleaning job. And um, I want a cleaning job. I want to buff my cleaning skill. And it seems quite simple. Ooh. Yeah, they're, 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 oh, that's that's a good one. That's a, that's a good one as well. Can I stack them? Oh, God, I can't stack them. I'll put them on the shelf then in a minute. There we go. What have you been doing? This has just been a dumping ground for you, isn't it, Max? Really? That's all you've been doing? You're just dumping your rubbish in here. You've just been opening the door and throwing it in, haven't you? It's not a good... It's going to get, get, get you later, mate. You're going to have to deal with... Well, actually, you don't have to deal with it eventually. You've done the other option, which is that... You either pay, you either do the work, or you pay. And you're going to pay to get rid of it instead. And, you know, maybe for something as messy as this, you do need a cleaning expert. And you'd be glad to know this, mate, but I am in that fact a cleaning expert. What is this? That's got to be disposal, isn't it? I can't move it. Is it plumbed in? It's not plumbed in. Okay. Uh, wh wh why is there a... I mean, is that just an old washing machine you've stuck in there because you don't know what to do with it? Or is, it, is that... I can't believe there's supposed to be a washing machine here. And a microwave. Why is there a microwave? Again, it's an old broken microwave. You bought a new microwave and you thought to yourself... I'm the same. And I'm not going to criticise you too much. But you thought to yourself, you know, it's a new microwave, but there's actually nothing wrong with the old one. Do I really need to throw it away? So you just stuck it in a corner somewhere. Well, you know what, Max? That thing's going to sit there, gathering dust, forever, basically. Because that's what happens. When you do. I know, from experience. You, you, if you don't want to throw it in the dump, or recycle it, and there probably is some useful stuff in there for a proper recycle. Don't just take it down the dump. You know, Take take it to a proper recycling centre. You know, they recycle everything these days. TVs and stuff. There's really valuable resources in, the, in these things. Have you been going rallying in this car? What have you been doing, Max? There's really valuable resources in some things. You heard about, you know, the amount of gold and precious metals in mobile phones and electronics. Well, same thing in TVs, like your screens and everything. And uh, probably in microwaves as well. So, you know, get a proper disposal place, proper, proper recycling place, or charity shop, or sort of like the charity shop. Certainly in the UK, you've got places like FreeCycle, which is where you simply go online and you say, I've got this thing that I want to uh, get rid of. There's nothing really wrong with it, particularly. Here's an honest opinion of what it's like. Does anybody want it? And I did that with one of my sofas. I had these two leather sofas, and we were going to get some new ones. They were like sofa recliners. And I've still got one in the house. And the other one's a little bit tatty. That little, you know what leather size does? It gets a bit cracked around the edges. So I said on the free cycle site, so you, hey guys, anyone want this? Come and get it. And a guy turned up and he had a... Is this from your teenage years, Max? Are you going to keep this? You, you want to you wanna keep that? Well, okay. quite. Um, you know, it's a big heavy sofa. Recline sofa. Anybody want it? And a guy came around with a, with a truck, with a, with a van, like a work van. And he took it. Excellent. And I felt that he was going somewhere... Useful. It wasn't good enough for him to sell it. If he wanted to sell it, fine. I'm not going to put the effort in. It's a bit easier than, you know, for the stuff that eBay, you don't want to put on eBay. Or anything like that. So there you go. Do that. Do that, man. But just leaving it here, it's just going to stay there. I don't think using a broom on your car is a good idea. Well, I might scratch the paintwork just a little bit. <laughs> Some sort of power washer. And really, I'm just here to, to, to buff my, my cleaning skills. Even beyond their the ultimate level that they already are. Kind of a nice little job. I did wonder when I saw, you know, Garage, smiley face, what he was going to ask us to do. But it's a good little job. Uh, what is... Am I missing a room or something here? The place is just dirt outside. Hold on. Oh, there's another room! Oh, okay. Oh, I didn't realise that. Nice little uh, workshop you got here. But again, Max, you're a very lazy man. Is this a bin? What do you want to throw a bin away for? Fine. Tires as well. You've got to dispose of those properly. I'm not even sure where I get rid of tires and myself. I, I'd imagine that uh, they go to the recycling as well, but I've never had to get rid of a tire like that. Don't know. But you could at least put your tools and things back on the shelf. You're a lazy man, Max. Maybe you're just a busy man. 
May let's let's not judge him. We don't know what he's like. Maybe he's just got a really busy life. At least he's not using this place to escape from the family. That's a common thing for, for dads. The shed or the or the garage. And that's not the right thing to do. Right then. Shouldn't take too long, this should it really? This is also planned on being a, a stress buster for me as well, because um, after the last house. Hmm, I just miraculously cleaned that shelf. <laughs> that window seal without doing anything. Maybe the sun's just come out. No, it's better dirty again. Okay. There we go. Uh, yeah, it's going to be a stress buster for me because I. Um, yeah, the last house was a little bit stressful. Uh, trying to get things done for Jimmy was a bit was a bit tricky. Uh, but the last one, I, I'm actually de-stressed anyway. Doing that for the for the for the old people was uh, well, was pretty relaxing. That was much more a little bit stressful in the middle when they. When they vanished, I couldn't seem to work out how to make them happy. But again, still learning about what the game wants. Not anything logical, necessarily. You leave your logic at the door, okay? Don't worry about it. Logic, of the, logic is not necessary in this game, necessarily. Put some pretty patterns up, and uh, don't, don't, don't stress yourself too much, because... Um, you may think it's madness that someone doesn't want someone doesn't want a bedroom. <laughs> so you're not putting a bedroom in, and they seem perfectly happy, old people. But you know, it's uh, that's their choice. They wouldn't be interested in the in the in the, uh, in the house if you were doing it wrong in some way. We'll see what they do with the updates in the future. See if the guys uh, change some of this craziness. Look at these damn shelves. I can't get that dirt in the corner. Whatever the heck it is. I'm not putting these back though, Max. That's, that's your job. And I'm not going to sort your flipping boxes. They're over here. That's just a, that's a bit much. I'll put them back on the shelf for you. But, you know, it's on the nearest shelves. You can you can do that yourself. See, my phone's buzzing. I'm getting other important um, cleaning jobs coming in. As soon as we get this one done, the better. There's a bit of cash for us. A bit more, bit more spending money for the next job. That's all it is. Oh, there's some rubbish over here. What needs to be... What needs to be got rid of? There's a bit under the windowsill. What's this? Is it on the shelf, maybe? What's this rubbish here? There's something here that's got to go. Is there a box I've missed? Ah, there it is! Oh, and a dirty tyre mark under the car. How I'm doing that, I have no idea. Open wall. Oh, the garage. Okay. It's clear of me. I think we're done, you know. If that is the case, a little bit over here, maybe a cobweb or something. That was not a bad little job. Let's just do a double check, make sure we're absolutely done. Because sometimes I've still got not got the fee, the full... Um, yeah, it says some more dirt somewhere. Yeah, I've not got the full radar, really, yet. Well, I haven't got the full radar, I guarantee. It's in the other room, the dirt. Um, so I, I, it is possible to miss things. Sometimes I see things that visually look like dirt, but I'm not, I'm not seeing them on the HUD, on the map. I'll chase it down. Ah, that's what I was talking about. See? The little tiny bit of visual dirt up there. That's what I'm still just trying to hunt down one more like that. Oh, got it. Whatever it was, it's now done. We are done. Let's get out of here. 6,000 quid. Max, you really paid through the nose for that, mate. Just to clean up a bunch of trash. Okay, nice little job. A house sale. And a... Um, I have to what? I have to a cleaning job. I've got loads of money as well. We haven't got a, no, we're running out of jobs, which is kind of a shame. Let's do some more of those. Um, what is the next one on the list, by the way? Just a matter of interest. Aunt's home to redecorate. It's a terrible condition. I would bulldoze it and build a new house. This one sounds like a great, a great money maker. That one. That's a terrible way to put it, but I think it is. 
Um, but we're not going to do that because next time what we're going to do is we're going to buy. I don't think I'll do any separate jobs for now. Oh, no, not, not for now. I might be just another ones off screen. But for now, it's this one, isn't it, I think? I want to see how they do in the pool as well. Three bathrooms and a pool. Well, one of those bathrooms might become a bedroom, depending on what it is. We're going to buy this one, I think, next time, though. And uh, it'd be nice to do a two-floor house. And I can't see who's going to want it, apart from, of course, the family. But we'll see what happens. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed that. And if you did, see you again next time.